Pixel. Please subscribe to our channel for more videos. Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to design a full contour crown with ExoCAD software. As explained in ExoCAD DB Part 1, first I need to fill in the needed information on the left. Now I select a molar in the upper jaw to work on. Click on anatomic crown with zirconia as the production material. On the right, there are more options such as minimal thickness and gap thickness of cement plus color. For some 3D scanners, the, the adjacent teeth should be defined. I select the first one and choose the rest by holding control button on the keyboard. And finally, lower jaw would be the antagonist. Use shift button to select all desired teeth. In order to save the job, first I need to define the scan mode. In this case, I should click on two stone models in occlusion. Now save the job and click on design. First step, first step of designing a crown is drawing margin line. Click on the tools and the margin line will be drawn automatically. You can correct any point of margin line by tap correct or draw and when finished click next in this step I should set the insertion direction for my molar the red part shown in the software is the undercut by looking from the occlusal side, I can minimize the undercut. When finished, click on Set Current View as Insertion Access and then click Next. The parts with undercut are shown with red color, as you see. Based on the undercut, the cement cap should be set. It is also possible to apply the gap to the entire tooth by set from margin to zero. I use the default mount and now click on undercut tab. For a better placement, it is advised to set the size to zero because it helps the dentist to place the crown better. Click on apply. You can keep the dentist informed about the existing undercut by sending a screenshot. In order to do so, click on Tools, then click on a Screenshot, and save the picture. The dentist will be aware of undercuts and maybe he or she decides to redirect the tools to avoid the undercuts. Click on Next. Check buccal and lingual side and then again click next. I activate show distance. This tab shows the collision with the antagonist. Red parts have more and blue parts have le less collision. Okay, let's work on the crown. I have several options on the left. 
Move is for moving the crown in all directions. Second option moves the crown in mesial and distal directions only. Third option moves the crown in buccal and lingual directions only. And the fourth option moves the crown in occlusal direction only. For rotate, the options are similar to the previous one. As you see, I apply the changes. Is exactly the same as move. Hotkeys are also available to use in ExoCAD. The point is shown in the picture. For scaling, also again the options help me to apply the changes in different directions. Okay, let's see how hotkeys work in ExoCAD. I select the move and now I can work with hotkeys by holding control button on the keyboard. I can rotate the crown to any desired direction. Please be aware that move is selected on the left side. By shift bottom, I can also use the scale for the crown. In order to see the relation, I can either check the antagonist from the left side or holding or by holding alt bottom from the keyboard. Hold it and release it and you can have your antagonist and check the relation. Now I check the crown from different views and by using hotkeys I try to complete the design. And also by activating show distance, the parts with collision are shown in the software. Click on next. I want to eliminate the collision, the cusp bottom is checked and gives me the opportunity to change the cusp's height. With two sports bottom, I reform the marginal ridge. And now it's time to work on molar's buckle contour. Click on tab 3, then adjust the strength and the brush size. Now form the contour as desired. The tab adapt helps me to correct both occlusal and proximal sides in two ways. Cut intersections or shape preserving adaptation. This part is explained completely in a separate video.
You can also see a photorealistic rendering of your restoration by, by uh, true small technology. I deactivate true small and continue. This was designing a full contour crown in ExoCAD. Please follow Wixer YouTube channel for more videos and thank you for watching.